Hiya, it's Andrew Bell, Ablesim here. Uh, this short video clip is about the work contours that you can apply to different assignments in Microsoft Project. So I'm going to open up a blank project. I'm going to make everything automatically scheduled. I'm going to insert task one, task two, task three, task four. And I'm going to go to the format view and put the project summary task on to make this look like a project. I'm now going to go to the resource sheet view, view the resource sheet, and I'm going to put in my resources, which is Sam and Alex. So most people are aware that if we double click a resource, we will get resource information. And on the Gantt chart, if we double click a task, we're going to get uh, task information. Um, what we need to look at, though, for work contours is assignment information. So I'm going to add the resource uh, Sam to task one. OK, and on task two, double clicking the task resource name, I'm going to put Alex. And um, Sam's also going to be doing task three. And Alex task four, different ways of adding resources. Uh, now then, because uh, Sam's working on two tasks, he's overloaded. I'm not interested in resource over allocations in this video clip. I'm just looking at work profiles or work contours. Now then, I need to enter exact amounts of uh, work and duration for these tasks. So what I'm going to do is uh, split the screen, right click, show the split. Task one has defaulted to eight hours of work. And I'm going to increase it to 20 hours of work. When I click OK, computer says that's two and a half days. But I'm going to make this fixed work and make it five day duration. So uh, Sam should be working four hours a day on that. We'll check that in a minute. Task two, Alex is working on it. I'm going to set this to be 10 hours of work initially. Computer says that's one and a bit days. Um, but I'm going to make it five days. I'm going to fix the work, fix the duration at five days as well. Computer's changed my work, so I need to put that back to 10 hours of work. So uh, 10 hours over five days, Alex should be doing two hours a day on that. We'll check that in a minute. Uh, we'll come to task three and four a bit later on in the uh, video. Let's remove the split. So let's look at these assignments. To go to assignments, I need to either be on the task usage view which is a list of the tasks and the resources that do them. And there's the assignment of Sam working on task one, and we can see he's working four hours a day. And here is Alex working on task two at two hours a day. A different way of getting to assignments is the uh, other usage view, the resource usage view. This is a list of the resources. Uh, Sam, he's working on task one and task three, and Alex, task two and task four. So we can see Sam, four hours a day on task one, Alex two hours a day on task two. And if I double click here, this is where I can change the work contour. Currently, it's flat. And that's how it spread that 20 hours of work over the five days. But I can make this backloaded. So Sam does more work towards the end of the task. So he's only going to do uh, just over an hour on Monday. But he's going to increase that to three and a half hours Tuesday, six hours Wednesday, eight hours on Thursday. And then that just leaves a little bit at the end on Friday to finish the task. Uh, on Alex, I'm going to make this one front loaded. And then Alex will do more of the work at the beginning, two hours on Monday and then less as we go through the week. And because these fitted into the week's duration, there was only 20 hours of work and there's only 10 hours of work, um, there's been no issues. I'm now going to go back to the Gantt charts and task three, split the screen. Sam is doing this. I'm gonna make this uh, 40 hours of work and I'm gonna fix the work at 40 hours and I'm gonna explicitly say it's five days. And then for task four, which Alex is doing, I'm gonna make this 40 hours of work Click OK. I'm going to make it fixed duration and I'm going to make it five days fixed duration. 
Now then, let's go back to the assignment views. We're going to go to the resource usage view, look at task three. So this is the um, fixed work task, 40 hours of work in five days. It fits eight hours a day. Um, but when I change the work contour to something like, uh, let's do a late peak on this one. The computer says, well, if you can do more work at the end to fit it all in, I'm actually going to have to increase the duration. So because we're doing so little in days one and two, three, and now we're increasing four hours, four hours, six hours, eight hours. Um, late peak, the, the, the duration has actually increased from five days to 10 days. So we've got to be careful when we add these work contours. Uh, let's have a look at um, task four, Alex. This was the fixed duration task. Uh, I'm going to put um, a, early peak on this one and the computer has said well actually because this is fixed duration whatever i do must fit into five days there's the early peak it's peaking on the tuesday but it's reduced the hours of work to 20 hours so you've got to be careful when you're adding work contours that your durations and your work content are not changing thank you for watching hope you enjoyed the video